Guess where I am? I am at the Salt Lake Temple in Salt Lake, Utah. I was about to say California. <laughs> and it's really cool out here. Everything's so peaceful. I was just inside of the temple doing confirmations because I have no life and I wanted something to do that was meaningful and progressive and something that Heavenly Father would approve of. So, ah, here we go. I talked to a lady on the inside of the temple grounds and she said that they had 63 weddings last Saturday. That's incredible. <laughs> Here's the fountain that looks like a river, I mean a lake, and it looks like they're walking on water. Whoa! It's pretty. And there's a temple again. Yay! <laughs> and it's beautiful. Okay. There's a family. <laughs> Lots of people take their families to the temple so they can enjoy the spirit which is here. And they can also rejoice in family bonding. Look! More wedding! She's so pretty! Look at her dress! Hi! I love your dress! It's so pretty! And congratulations! Oh. I hear that Salt Lake City has these amazing restaurants, especially at the top of the Joseph Smith Memorial Building, which is this building. And I am going to go inside and check out their restaurant. And it's high up in the air. So here we go. I'll let you know if the food's any good. Ooh, dancing. Look, Joseph Smith. Going to the 10th floor. Hi. This place is amazing. on the 10th floor and they have a beautiful fountain. It's so pretty. And they have some fabulous restaurants here. Hi. <laughs> Whoa, you can see the construction site and some tall buildings and a uh, very important building and the church headquarters. That's the church headquarters. That building controls pretty much all Mormonism. <laughs> Which is amazing, by the way. I think I can see my house from here in California. Yeah, I'm really starving, so I'm gonna go find some food. This place is beautiful. I should probably run. Hungry. Hey. <laughs> hungry. Hungry. Very hungry. Ooh, windows. Another fountain. Oh man. Look to me. Two restaurants? Is there two restaurants? The, the same one? Different restaurants? Oh. Fried pickles? Ah. And I'm really hungry and whoa, what is this? Ah. I cannot contain myself right now. <laughs> I think I may eat at that restaurant. Let me just check out the other one. I heard there was a restaurant here. Yeah. This one's a lot more spiritual than the other one. <laughs> I like 
I was just doing confirmations and I decided I should do an enlightening meal. Mormons love food. <laughs> it looks really pretty in there. Is there somebody playing the piano? Uh -huh. Really? Wow. Um, do you serve fried pickles? No. <laughs> <laughs> for fried pickles. I saw that and I was like, well, um, okay, you can't compare to that. Here's another amazing view from this restaurant. It was either the fine dining restaurant, or I could go, which is called The Roof, or I could go and eat at this other restaurant called The Garden, and they have amazing meals there. If you look to your left, actually my left, my right, the right, I'll just say the, the light. <laughs> look towards the light. I'll just stop. An empty plate, how sad. There's some of the things they'll be serving. <laughs> Looks good. I have a partial view, but it's acceptable. You can see the tumble in the corner of our eyes. You can almost see the beach from here. Okay. I'm about to eat here. I have an empty place so far, but by the time I'm finished, this place will be very dirty. It will be very dirty. dirty. <laughs> I'm eating bread and butter, peach lemonade, and fried pickle. <laughs> this is one of their menu options. It's so cool. <laughs> After this amazing view and this amazing meal today, it's been great. What an adventure. And to top it all off, look at my dessert. <laughs> Not to mention peach lemonade. <laughs> this is a fantastic place and it has a fantastic view and there's a lot of fantastic people here. My waiter was very nice. <laughs> okay, well, time to enjoy. But they are amazing. Not only do they have an amazing view, but the rooftop opens up. <laughs> Back to my dessert. Mm, that meal was incredible. <laughs> now I'm just looking over at the beautiful temple of Salt Lake City, Utah. And all of Utah, which never gets boring. <laughs> this place is great. And that restaurant is amazing, and I will always come back to that one because they're so nice, and because the food was amazing, and because, look at my belly has expanded. <laughs> hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. I love you, and I'm far, far away, but I'm being good, and I just went to the temple, and <laughs> which means I'm being good. I just found something amazing. Look, this is a mouse on a giant screen, and when you touch it, the mouse goes there. <laughs> I see a light over there. <laughs> okay, I'll stop. Maybe if I pull this hand cart. I could get all my kids to follow me. Are we there yet? Shh. Hey guys, quit complaining and help me out with this. Pull, pull. <laughs> I think it's moving. Looks like they're getting somewhere. <laughs> how are you doing this evening? I'm happy, how are you? Very good. Can I pay your horse? Yes, this is fine. Thank you. 
His name is Bob? Yes. Hi, Bob. I'm Cory. I'm black, too. Well, actually, I'm only half, but... <laughs> this is a really pretty horse. Aw, you're so friendly. Hey. You're not afraid of cars? She's so soft. Is this a girl or a boy? Cisco. Oh, sorry, Cisco. Hi. Look, me and Cisco together on a worldwide adventure. I don't think he wants. He doesn't want any autographs. <laughs> I've decided to take a horse ride. So I am on a carriage right now, and I'm about to ride Cisco, which was the white horse. <laughs> I'm really excited. Yay! This is amazing. I am on a horse and carriage riding through Temple Square. It can't get better than this. <laughs> a beautiful temple. This is the perfect night. I mean, I had nothing to do. And now, I'm on a horse and I'm full. I just ate at a wonderful restaurant and I did confirmations of the temple. and It's been amazing. I'm at the Family History Center. I think I'm going to do some things today and see if I can get any for the temple. <laughs> Look, I just got some names. This is my great grandma. Her name is Maureen Sanders. It's Grandma Mary's mom. And then this is her husband, Melvin Luther Smith, Sr. And look, they're going to get filled and they're going to have their happily ever after. I'm so excited. <laughs> Dedicated helpers and dedicated work, and a worthy temple recommended. I hope I'm gonna help them get their work done. <laughs> I'm so excited! Yay! Today has been pretty much amazing. <laughs> Yay! I was just at the Family History Center, and it is beautiful. And I got a few names, and we're gonna get them sealed. Yay! <laughs>